Oh, the it, money goes in here, drops right and through. And it falls all the way through. It goes right into hers. Oh, what a great idea. I like that design. What a deal. If we buy it, would you start saving your coins in there? Heading into Bethesda Thrift Shop. This is uh, one Peggy likes. It's out in Minnetonka, west side of the Twin Cities. And we're gonna go in and see what they have. Well, they got the sign in the window, so maybe it is senior day today. That'd be nice. Ooh. <laughs> that was strange, wasn't it? Uh, went down my back almost. Yeah, it was weird. Thank you. Wow, this place is really big. We've been in here before. Lots of clothes. And then, all the goodies are over here. There's Peggy Lou. I see they got a whole second here on Halloween already. I'll let Peggy take over. She's the master at describing things. But all I can say about the Halloween is that it's mostly orange. This little ceramic basket looks vintage. That poor little chick. It's um, flocked, but he's missing his little beak. But he has little wire feet. And this is a little um, feather, feather felt and chenille with little plastic feet. So that looks old. Looks like very old little flowers in there too. But they fall out when you pick them up. I was gonna look at the bottom. Uh, 1981 maybe. Yep. So it is older. See the poor little chick falls out. He's <laughs> so flat. It looks older. Funny that the 80s are seem so old now. Boy, this looks older. It's shaped like the hall pieces. H A L L. 1999. Kind of strange. I don't think I've ever seen that before. I don't want to pick it up. Maybe Norm can pick it up later. This is a pretty shaped vase. I didn't see anything on the bottom of it, but I don't like these nude people are just really weird on here. They've got t tail looking bodies with tails on them. They're really weird. I just don't think that's cool. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. That's very bizarre to me. I don't know about that. See, but these, these look vintage. Oh yeah, it's Taiwan. Doesn't look like your neck's broke or anything. Yeah, they're Taiwan. Did I see a price? On the back, $3.99. Jeez. Each. Wow. That's not a bad piece uh, for $2.99. Nice amber votive with a pretty twisted stem on it. Oh, and there's oh, something red back here. It's awfully dark though. Oh, that is dark. What is that? Dollar ninety nine. Chicken shell. Never seen that one before. Too dark for me though. I like a brighter red. And what was I seeing up here? older glass. 
heavy, so that is not a sherbet. It's too deep, I think, for a sherbet. It's $2.99. Kind of a pretty votive back there. I've always liked the diamond cut. 99 cents. It's quite heavy. Oh, look at this. Oh my goodness, this is so tiny. $1.99. That looks to me like a... See how tiny that is? A miniature butter dish. Like a, I would think of that as a child's, you know, little butter dish. Very cute. Wow, look at these old candles. Original sticker. For those chimes. Like the Scandinavians make. Boy, this is just really packed in here. We have not been here for... Oh, I don't know how long. I'd say maybe six months. This is Avon. Very, very cute. I do collect these. 99 cents. It still has a perfume in it. So that's a pretty good deal when you consider Avon things are quite expensive. And this is a little Avon. Birdie too. That's more. Hmm. I think that might be more of a sachet in there, or is that what you call it? And it's a gel type thing. Could be, but I think the doggy's really sweet. Very cute. That's very tempting. And this is cool. Look at that. Wow. I wonder if that's new. It sure doesn't look like it to me. I think I would like to dip this, even though there's a couple chips on it because oh my gosh that is not that is very old $3.99 that's worth it to me let me stop my camera here well, I think this is adorable it is a luminaire because the candle is built right in the candle holder and you can see how old and worn this is on the bottom. There's no identification, but he's chipped up here, but I'm not worried about that. I can fix him up. I use testers, enamel paints. A lot of people keep asking me, what do you use? Testers, enamel, uh, gloss. I would use gloss because you've got a very glossy finish there, but look at, that's a little bird sitting on its trunk. So I think that's adorable. And you can see here is a vintage little donkey planter. $3.99 is not bad. That is tempting, but I've got enough donkeys. And these could be vintage. They're $1.99 each, but because they're covered up on the bottom. It actually, it feels like wood. It really feels like wood. Um, it's not heavy. It has a number. It's like $3.99. I would not be getting them, but I just thought I'd show them to you. Yeah, I wish I knew where Norm was so he would carry this around for me. <laughs> he won't like that. Oh, look at that little pump down there. <gasps> that is cute. I'm going to have to set Mr. Elephant down. That is adorable. And that is vintage. Oh my gosh. $3.99. Isn't that sweet though? Oh, how cute. A lot of people don't like spending four dollars on things. I'm gonna have to call Norm. He needs to get a card for me, I guess. I'm right now not using anything. Here's a little vintage bird made in Japan. They want $1.99 for it. 
Not shipped anywhere. That's different. I don't, you know what? That's a clothespin thing. Is that for holding a recipe card or something? I don't know. There's one with a duck on it too. Look at all the little, um, no, oh, I don't even remember what the name of them are, those little children. Oh, I can't remember. Oh, look at these guys. Okay, so they probably have put quite a bit of vintage stuff over here. You can see that, like, these guys. There's a word for a person like you. Terrific. <laughs> Funny. So, yeah, there's some vintage things here. A little bowl and pitcher. Oh, there's Norm standing right next to me. I'm getting this guy. I know he's got a little chips, Norm, but I'm going to be doing an African type. He is an old luminaire that you put a candle in. Yep. And it glows, yeah. Yeah, it's like my owls. You didn't get a car yet, did you? No, and look at this. Isn't that adorable, old planter? Yeah. That is so cute, that planter. Look at the little donkey I was showing everybody. So this must be some of the vintage things over here. There's a, a very pretty fish plate. Beautiful. Um, usually they're chipped up. It's not the kind of thing I get, but you can see that tiny little sticker but boy that's been hanging around for oh see the leaf right there oh, the tip yeah. of the leaf the tip is broken. yeah yeah, yeah. I, it's not something we need by any means but oh wow look at that that's an agate or what do you call that alabaster or agate is that agate it's alabaster $2.99 so is that a soap dish or a trinket dish. Probably a trinket dish. Pretty small for trinkets. I think it's for salt. Could be. So there's a few crazy things over here. I thought this was cute. This is definitely vintage by a little foil sticker on it. Too hard to read. You probably could make it out eventually. Japan. I see Japan on it. So that, yes, is definitely an older piece and these are probably 80s do you think oh see the felt bottom that's a good sign uh -huh. they're old yeah. um how do you do that he's it's supposed to be hanging off that's yeah. ridiculous yeah you worry about oh, that yeah but they're sort of sort of getting a little comeback i think people are talking about them and this is definitely older, $3.99, but I don't collect those kind of swans either. Oh, that is cute. This is probably for hanging hot pads on. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. That's really cute, $2.99. Yeah. That's funny. Really cute. Oh wow, look at these kids up here. Pretty sweet. Yes, oh my goodness. I bet it's pretty crowded. Typically, we, I told everybody we only get out. We probably haven't been here for six months. $4.99 for him. So they're probably both $4.99. That is very sweet. Ceramic. They have beautiful faces. Very nicely painted. Yeah, I need to stop this because it's it is getting too long. Isn't this cute? It's a pin cushion. Isn't that cute? Ninety nine cents only. Yeah, that's funny. I'll show you the back of her hair. You just can't tell with a lot of things, of course, how old they might be. That's very sweet for a sewing room, isn't it? 
Oh, there's a soda truck. Looks like they put a lot of vintage things over here too, what they felt were sorta vintage. I don't know what I'll see. They have um, rearranged this place. Oh, there's a, I think that's a pink Pyrex piece. Oh, wow. Fire King, oh my gosh. Wow. It's in beautiful condition. It's $8.99. Yes, that's a good deal if you really needed something like that, but I'm sorry, it's kind of dark over here. See if I can get you some better light. Yeah, it is really a beautiful coral color. Um, I was going to turn it over for you so you can see. Nowhere to set it down. All the shelving is just packed around here. Fire King. Anchor Hawking Fire King, it says. That's in pretty nice condition. Yeah. Let's go see what else there is here. Isn't that funny? $6.99. Not my style, but I thought I might get a kick out of seeing that. Oops, sorry. Okay. Nice, tiny little dish. Some imports, Japan import. little fan awful lot of figurines in this area so it's probably not the best area to be in but now these are fun I see these around I'm not holding my camera very well there am I sorry about that I keep doing that 99 cents oh well see that is worth it to me but these are bells I don't need bells Oh, look at that. A man of colonies in Iowa. Very fun. Oh my goodness, somebody had probably a little collection. This isn't anything on this side. My house. My house is small and a mansion for a millionaire, but there is room for love and there is room for friends. That's all I care. Yeah, that's nice, but this is a very fun toothpick holder. I think I'll get that for 99 cents. Isn't this pretty? I have milk glass plates. That is very nice. Um, but this is not milk glass. I have milk glass plates that kind of have that fleur de lay, fleur de lay, sort of. I think. I think I do, anyways. Two ninety nine. It is Norcrest. Yeah, pretty fancy, huh? But it's not milk glass. Nope. So I don't mix them. If I find a milk glass little milk glass plate with hand painting on it. I will sometimes pick that up. I like that. Copper plate. Fireplace, there we go. <laughs> That's the way it goes. That is $2.99. That's a pretty good price, if you like that. Um, I just want to show you this huge $14.99 Lazy Susan. It's a beaut. Oh my gosh, that's a metal tray. Wow. Isn't that nice? That's just a huge... Is that a tin? Lazy Susan, yeah, on a tin. Mm. I'm getting this little, little, um, Illinois owl for 99 cents. 
look at this. Yeah, I know. You're going by her. Just looking, I'm sure. Everything is noisy over here. That is very textured. Very, very textured plate. Japan, this says Japan. $9.99. Look at this. Must be, uh, do you think, an old bread box? Huh, I can't get it open right now. Looks like a big old bread box. Oh, here's a cute doll set. Wicker, wicker, wicker doll set. Look at the size of these kids up here. Oh, they are really big. I bet a lot of people would like this. Very pretty. Oh, it looks like old ceramic to me. Yeah, it's been around. $1.99. That is cute if you collect pictures. Oh my, look at this. Had to show it to you. That says Linda is very crazed. So I picture that being a corral, no corn, cornile, corn, corneal. I don't know. That's very cute. Looks pretty new. Too bad stuff has to get crazed like that. But this is a very, very nice. $2.99 old ceramic fruit pitcher. Let me see what that says in the bottom. $19.90. It says three quarters quart. It's Fitz and Floyd. When you know they do have nice things. Isn't that pretty? Don't see any crazy on there. On this side, there's oh, that's even prettier yet. Let me put it up here. Look at that, a lemon, oh my, that is really sweet. Very, very sweet, what did I say? Where's the price? $2.99, yeah, I like this side. Oh, sweet, very, very sweet. Oh, there's one of those common, 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 big old fruit bowls. I don't know, is that something Indiana Glass did? I'm not sure. $5.99. Seems quite pink, pink. So, I, it's an old pitcher and bowl back there, another one. That almost looks like red clay, doesn't it? Well, yeah, it says. Norlands, Norlands, Japan. So, yep, that is older, and I don't see a price. Oh well, it's over here. I remember when those were really popular. Bottles look uh, flashed. My hands feel a little grungy now. Bummer. Look at all the pictures. Oh my. Everything imaginable. Clear glass. That's really cute. You'd have to fill him full of syrup. That's what I would do. Isn't he cute, Norm? How much? $1.99. $1.99. Yeah, I think that'd be a fun thing to show. With syrup in it. There's lots of kind of fun bottles here. Look at these, Norm. 
I wonder if these are um, oil and vinegar. That looks like a, a sterling top on it, doesn't it? I bet they're expensive. Yeah, well, $3.99, it feels like really good glass. Yeah, aren't they funny? Yeah, that is very cute. So that's probably uh, oil. Doesn't say. $7.99. Cruets. Serp salad dressing. This whole area. Yeah, well, I hope that wasn't too boring for you guys. Oh, wow. Look at this, Norm. Isn't this sweet? That looks really retro. It's got crazing on it. What does that say on the bottom? Can you read? It's $9.99. That's a little pricey. England. England. Right? Oh, England. it's an English teapot. That's very, very retro style. It would be real cute in any mod. 70s kitchen, huh? 60s, yeah, 70s. Yeah. How much? $9.99. Yeah, $10. well, that's not bad. I'm going to get you for 10 bucks. Yeah. No, I don't need it. I got, look at the honey bears, too. Okay. Yeah, there's a real variety of stuff in here. This is adorable. That's really cute. No markings. I worry tipping anything over like that. Gotta make sure they really got tape on it. Yeah, a lot of teapots in here. I mean, that looks old. Oh. You sure you're not gonna wanna do this? Why? Get it? $9.99, I'll give you a real deal. I'll sell it here for 10. Oh, okay. I don't know. I don't have any room. All hand painted. Uh, little... there are. Made in Japan. Yeah, see? That's not a new piece either. He's pretty cute. I don't do that. We would never have that much honey sitting out. This is a retro relish dish back here. Um, wouldn't you call that Scandinavian? Oh boy, they got some glass. Look like coffee pot tops in it. Yeah, this is your, oh, that looks a little. What is that for? It's a relish thing. It's a little relish thing. Oh. A lot of people like the kind of Danish look. You relish the idea of getting it? No. I'm making noises here. Things fall over. I, everything has been, everything has been pretty crowded in here. That music is terrible, but it's not singing. I hope my phone is not picking that up. That's sweet. I've always liked um, finding little pumpkins, little odd salt and pepper pumpkins. That looks nice. This is old looks old. It feels flashed for some reason. Yeah, so there's there's little old things over here. Oh, look at this western. That's a guy riding a horse. Fucking Bronco. And it says... Oh, I see a trivet next to me. Thrift Co. Golden Aspen by Thrift Co. $2.99. Oh, isn't this cute? The other side. Yeah, that's adorable. I gotta get, the, oh my gosh, this weighs a ton. Oh man, it's stone. Wow. That's all stone. Very, very heavy. I was looking at this, but that's really too early American for me. <laughs> very, very funky. Oh, that's crazy. Never seen that one before. $3.99. I don't see Japan on there. Well, wait a minute. Yep, it is. I should have known it's pretty old. Here's 
very funny. Nah, that's not my style. But Norm Rod. No, oh, brother. <laughs> that is funny, though. Kind of over there where cute. you were. I thought you would have seen it for sure. Yeah. Oh, the it, money goes in here, drops right through. And it through, falls all the way it goes there. right into hers. Oh, what a great idea. I like that design. What a deal. If you buy it, would you start saving your coins in there? You know, Norm, Norm has a huge stash of coins. Huge. Huge. He just, he it's doesn't huge. get around. Well, you could explain why. You never get them. Well, the banks don't take away if you just dump it into their machine and it counts through it all. Yeah, you they stop to, doing uh, that. Put our, it in these little tubes and take it someplace. Our bank stopped doing that. Here's the bottom half. Three ninety nine. Jeez, that's the bottom half of a. I think there's no ridge on it though. Oh, that's weird. Bottom half of what? Uh, uh, um, this is exactly like the bottom half of a. Um, Fairy lamp. Ramp, yeah. But there's no ridge on it inside. That's odd. There's a little old milk glass. I've got some of these. They sure ask a lot for these now. They're just little little berry bowls for um for a bigger bowl, which I've had. Ooh, yeah, that's plastic. Plastic. glass. I don't think there's going to be a whole lot over here. Oh, well, he's good. Kind of cute. No. Not my thing. This looks old. $4.99. Don't know who would have made that, but... Sure. Yeah, here's an old cheese tray with a tile on it. Pretty simple. $3.99. Uh, some old old bowl back here. $3.99 for that. That's a very nice gold bowl. Norm left the cart with me because I can't carry everything in this. Whoa, forgive me, it's so heavy. I can hardly lift this. $3.99, oh my goodness, that's so heavy. I think my mother had that in clear. Oh, it's noisy here, sorry. No class. That is, Kind of retro fun. Brown butterfly. Okay, let's see. That is very nice. I actually bought one of these. They're expensive um, in antique malls. That is really pretty. Um, wow. I I bought a couple of smaller sizes. I want to see $6.99. Yeah, that figures. It's not marked, but I know it's... Uh, wow, that's quite a pattern on there. I have to set it back down here. It's can't get a grip on it. It's not easy filming with one hand and trying to lift heavy things. I want... I don't know if I got showed you the all that um, lines in it. Besides the veins, there's all those lines that I don't recall seeing. But boy, that is really heavy. Wow, it's very pretty. Oh my! Somebody's digging through the silverware thing. I'm so sorry. So sorry, let's go look some other aisle.
this says Royal Crown on a label on the bottom. It's a music box. I wonder what it plays. Kind of fun. This is um, pretty elaborate. $2.99. Japan, I assume. What are these? Two little wooden cats. Pretty fancy kids. So much stuff here. This is, looks like a salt and pepper set to me. I've never seen anything that modern in brass. That's really amazing. But I can't get over, well, $3.99 each, yeah. That is definitely a salt and pepper set. Isn't that crazy? A new one on me. I'm not seeing it. There's the Avon things again. I just came back to the same area. I'm not, that looks old. Oh my gosh. Oh boy, that scared me. Wow. This is wood. It's old. $5.99. I think it's old. I really do. That is crazy. <laughs> wow. Renaissance? Is that Renaissance? I don't know. That is nice. That's a very nice piece. Come back to it. Yeah. That would be very fun in the fall when I take out all my amber glassware. It would be fun if I could find some old Corel and look at what's on the bottom down there. Yeah, it's got to be old Corel. That's sweet, but it looks 80s to me. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry, but I am not going to bend down right at the moment. Mauve. I don't know if that's a teal. Looks like kind of a teal green. Not my style. I've got, like I've said, a lot of the uh, butterfly gold that I love. Oh my goodness. Look at how much Halloween stuff they have out already. See, that's all Easter over there that I have to look at one little thing so the back of the Easter must be fall and then Halloween there and I see a touch of 4th of July and Christmas is further down Wow that's early I mean some thrift stores I think they're starting to keep stuff out all the time they just got so much of it <laughs> That's not bad, 99 cents each for some very pretty, wintry, heavy-bottomed glasses. Cute. I like artificial cookies and candy. There's a whole bag of these suckers. They're very cute, but $6.99, I'm sure it's well worth it a lot of them but I don't need it I don't need it I just want to show you um, what was I looking at this he's pretty fancy isn't he for $4.99 I don't think he's broke wow he's really cute looks like something Lennox would do right yeah made by nobody yeah that's crazy hmm you'd think it would be marked he's really good yeah. condition huh pretty cute it is yeah 
Yeah. You want uh, No. No, he's not white. You want, I... learn, you want to learn how to speak Spanish? Hmm. There's so many people walking around, we don't know if they're talking about us when they... Yeah, they well, you know what? We, we get... I just did... I think I just did get a a comment on our channel. Yeah. A very sweet one, and I'm pretty sure it was Spanish. Yeah? Yeah, it was. So I was trying to decipher it. Oh, Norm, look at two of them. I was collecting tins? these tins. Yeah, we don't have him. He's a big, tall guy. I think I saw him at Goodwill, and I passed him up because they want usually want so much for him. Two ninety nine. He's very nice for two ninety nine, Norm. He's in good shape. Very nice. Good. Yeah, I can't believe there's two of them. Let me see. Yeah, them. I was always thrilled whenever I'd run across a, a great big um, tin soldier. They're both in good shape. I, I mean, one is enough. Obviously. You don't need two? No, I don't need two. Yeah. Yeah, that's the reddest hair, I think, of all of them that we've gotten. And tall. He's a real tall one, Norm. Most of ours are shorter than that. I like this one a little better. Okay. They were selling for a lot on the internet because I was kind of looking to see what others there were out there. Oh. Oh, there's so much Christmas stuff here. Thank you. That's that'll be fun. I I um, did thrift, not thrift. I did donate some of ours because I had too many, and I think it was the shorter ones. Those cute little wooden boxes. Oh, is he big? Huge. There's so much stuff you can get so cheap. See, these look vintage. Um, they're plastic, and unfortunately, you can't see, but this to me looks like a Hallmark salt and pepper set. You know, Hallmark always had these cute little plastic sets. Hallmark always had cute little holiday uh, plastic sets like that. I like my old Japan ones though that are um, ceramic. I really like them. I ended up with a nice collection of them, so I'm gonna stick with those. But I used to collect, like when I could find the Thanksgiving ones, they're so cute. Little chipmunks or whatever. Yeah, and I like the little plastic turkeys, they're okay. Does this get in the mood for Christmas yet? Oh, look at that swan. <laughs> oh, nice glasses. I used to have those. I only have one of these, Norm. Oh, dear. Oh, man. I've... Oh, man. I actually, oh, man. I've not had these. I have oh, different, I have different ones. That's the one we have one of, but no, it's not necessary. 99 cents. Oh, look at this, just Christmas everywhere. Boy, they must, they must really, it's just, yeah, it's not brass. They must really need to get rid of their stuff to have that much. And all these stockings and towels. Look at all the Easter stuff they have, and that's already over. Well, that's just one row. This is three three aisles oh look at that that is a hobbyist boot oh my gosh that's big enough for Santa that's that's bigger than full size yeah. isn't that funny I bet that's expensive I'm sorry about the music I might get in trouble for that well, I'm gonna give you a deal on this one too the boot is just so funny isn't that cute I wouldn't want to store that no it's new $22.99. It's $9.99 here and you can have it for ten bucks. I didn't I didn't expect that to be no. It is adorable. No, I I don't want to store it. It's it's sweet. There's too much music playing here. It's a pretty basket for $7.99.
probably older. Hmm? Norm looks good in a skirt, don't you think? <laughs> probably my style. He held this up um, for me to show you. It is only six ninety nine. dollars palm. It's very pretty. Parts of palm. Yeah, it just looks like an older skirt, 100% polyester. New York, New York, New York. So it could be older. Yeah, very nice. Pretty colors. It, it's kind of, does that remind you of a snakeskin look? Some kind of reptile look, don't you think, Norm? Yeah. To made impressionistic um, painting of it, though. Yeah, it's nice. That's what I think of. Okay. So this is how big this place is. Norm probably did this part already, but it is really, really a good sized place. And they have lots and lots of vintage things over here. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's the same set my brother had right here. Look at that, $49.99. Um, the, the very biggest lid we re-spray painted because it was, it was kind of chipped up and worn. Yeah, he had that in his kitchen up high with a whole bunch of copper stuff. So, wow, we got senior discount. Isn't that great? Yeah. Thanks for coming along with us today. I hope you had a really great week. I would just love looking through those jackets there. Our little pair of ducks that love to be in our backyard all day long because Norm keeps a pile of cracked corn out there for him. If we put out whole corn, the chipmunk takes a ton of it and a squirrel or two just keep burying it all over the garden. But they don't do that with the cracked corn. They um, really splash around a lot. Yeah, she's really looking hot, isn't she? Yeah, see Norm? When we've got it pretty zoomed in on her 10 times. Oh, wow, look at that. Isn't that crazy? You must be looking at her thinking, wow, what's the matter with you? <laughs> she's doing the back of and he's got the frog behind him. That's what's funny. Okay. Wow. Not some most. Save is. some water in the pond, girl. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she's cute. Y'all yeah, tired out she's now? Exhausted now. Yeah. No, not quite. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, they get really frisky out there. I don't know what it is, but all of a sudden they started liking the upper pond better. Yeah. It's like, it's it's like a little jacuzzi <laughs> with the waterfalls. Right. Yeah. See? Oops. Oh, sorry to move too fast. Not going to have like any feathers crazy. left if she's not careful. <laughs> Just in time. That's, oh, she's finally getting out. And he's sitting over there saying, now don't get me wet. <laughs> <laughs> you know how dogs do that to you? Oh, boy. <laughs> She's putting on a show. Yeah, that's cute. We enjoy watching them. It's nice that there's just one pair, basically. He seems to chase off anybody. Even if a female comes here oh, yeah. all by herself, he will chase her away, right away. Yeah. So I think they've taken over. You know, we used to talk about lonely guy all the time that's who would be so here all day long sleeping on the back of the pond way back. Um, yeah, we haven't seen him since May. I don't think we saw him in June. Mm. And now, yeah, it's very strange. Maybe this guy has kind of taken over. Yeah, well, I gotta go make dinner. I'm starving. Yes, it's plenty of We just got tired. back home from the thrift store. Got a good video for you guys, I think. Found some fun things. Okay, see you later. Mm -hmm.